Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Alhamdulillah, first and foremost, we thank Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala for the opportunities uh, given by Allah uh, so that we continue to live with Iman and Islam. Uh, Allahumma barik lana fi sha'ban wa balna ramadan. Allahumma salli ala Sayyidina Muhammad wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa barik wa sallim. Alhamdulillah, uh, we are about uh, to enter into the month of Ramadan and one of uh, the importance in the month of Ramadan is the Quran. The Quran is the main reference in Islam. Uh, Quran is, is a guide, a huda. Uh, also Quran provides us Quran uh, to differentiate between the truth and uh, the, the, the what called the, the fake in our life. Uh, so therefore, Quran is also a mercy to all of us. Uh, therefore, in the month of Ramadan, we should always uh, close ourselves eh? or to be in to be intimate with the Quran. Uh, of course, people have a lot of activities that related to the Quran. Uh, people have the recitation, tadarus. Uh, people have the tazkirah uh, to remind people about the lessons from the Quran, and and people uh, attempted their best to read the entire Quran, uh, and and also in the in the prayers in the taraweh, uh, people invited uh, the hufas uh, to recite Quran uh, one juzu per night. Okay, and uh, when we complete uh, the 30 days Ramadan, we also completed the 30 juz of the Quran. And therefore, uh, and Quran, uh, belief in the Quran is also part of our pillars of uh, uh, Iman. And therefore, uh, in Surah an nam verse 77, uh, Allah mentioned that Quran is a guide and also mercy for the believers. Therefore, brothers and sisters, uh, let us prepare ourselves to understand, to comprehend, and also to practice Quran uh, so that uh, we will be guided by Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. May Allah bless. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.